AI and machine learning sort of technology has really a, 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 has the potential to make a very big difference in this whole area. And uh, I sort of think of this in terms of uh, three dimensions in which uh, machine learning uh, technologies can really make a difference. One in sort of expanding uh, the boundary of what is today possible. Right. So, of course, uh, even in structure prediction, it was possible to find the structure of, uh, of proteins, but it took a lot of time and uh, only very few organizations had the capacity to, to do it. So by using this technology, we can now expand uh, what could be done. Uh, secondly, we, we can accelerate this process because computational structure prediction, I mean, uh, the structures that we have shared uh, with the database, the researchers don't have to wait for years on end to wait for a structure. They can just download it in a matter of seconds. And then finally, we have made this technology accessible to people and scientists who didn't have access to uh, these very expensive machines uh, to get uh, uh, structures for the proteins that they were interested in. Uh, so these are the sort of three ways I think uh, AI and machine learning can make a big difference.